In this problem, we have to complete the square. So basically, we have to find the value of n that makes this what's called a perfect square trinomial. So to find n so that this can be factored and we can complete the square, uh, the first step is to take this number here, which is our b. So b is equal to 8. And then you just divide it by 2 and square it every time. So you take the number in front of this one, in front of the t, and divide it by 2 and square it. So 8 over 2 is equal to 4. And then 4 squared is equal to 16. So that's your n. n is equal to 16. So now let's go ahead and put it there. So t squared plus 8t plus 16. Okay, so now this will factor. How? So basically, it's just from memory. So you just put a parentheses and a t, and then a parentheses and a 2. And then just from memory, you keep the sign, and then you just take this number and divide it by 2 every single time. Boom, that's it. So that's the answer. So this always magically factors into this. That's the cool part. Once you put the 16 here, you don't actually have to think about factoring. That's the whole point of completing the square, is that if you divide this by 2 and square it, and you put it where the n is, this will always work. You just take this, divide it by 2, keep the sign. I hope this video has been helpful.